guys, I'm back with the McDonald's today. I don't think I've done a McDonald's mukbang for you guys. I mean, it's a couple stuff. Oh man, the hamburger got like tiny. Been a long day, lots of traffic. I hope you guys are doing well. I got the six piece chicken nuggets and then I ordered hamburger with lettuce but the way the hamburger got so small. I got this till it kind of ties me over. We, I had leftovers from yesterday but that wasn't a lot. And then we had, we might do ground beef with pasta at home. There is the six piece. I like McDonald's chicken nuggets. Let's see. Tiny hamburger also. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. I got it with lettuce. This is how small it is now. <laughs> it's like a baby. I think both of this was like five something. Was there any pickles in this? Okay. I didn't know if I should get um a cheeseburger, a hamburger. I guess cheese has a little more fat. And then I got my, I got a yogurt, green tea, but that's from another place. <laughs> Everywhere went kind of, it kind of changed after COVID, you know? We went to, uh. Thai, uh, Thai food last night with my husband. There wasn't a lot of customers and it was only like two workers working there. So see no staff. I mean, I don't really get a lot of McDonald's anymore. I like their chicken nuggets and my mom likes their quarter pounder. We haven't ate from Chick-fil-A in a while because that got pricey, but I still like them. Also, let's see. We went to Thai Princess yesterday. I delivered from there, but I never ate from there. Because yesterday was four years me and my husband met online. And then on October 15th, we met in person. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, I'm really glad God brought me to my husband. And I wish everyone, you know, good happiness with someone or I hope they meet, you know, if they're single, meet someone that they really love and have a lot of stuff in common with. I tell him, uh, I lost my dad in 2018 and then I gained you in 2019. Like nothing's gonna change the place of your dad, but it's still sad, very sad, you know. I wish my dad got to meet uh, Jerry. I got it with barbecue sauce, the chicken nuggets. I can't believe it's October. I love October though because I really like um, fall and Halloween stuff. And I am wearing eyeliner today. Um, I haven't worn in a while. I just got these from CoverGirl. 
I guess I don't really wear a lot of makeup anymore, but I do have some at home. I like mascara and chapstick. Yesterday I got their uh, fried rice with pineapple and chicken. Oh, that was really good from the Thai place. The work's been kind of slow and lows today and some customer kind of annoyed me. I wasn't too bothered they put in the address wrong. I mean, it said it was Nike, and then it brought me from across from him, and then he, I called, and then he said, like, he gave me the new address, and I had to, like, return because there was a lot of traffic, and he was waiting outside, and I gave him the bag, and then he looked at the bag, maybe he thought there was more items, because there is a lot of fees with Uber or DoorDash. And then I saw later, because Uber Eats, they tip you an hour later, he lowered my rating score, like it was 99 and I got 98 now, and he never tipped. Well, you apologized to me saying, you know, wrong address. I mean, like, sorry, like I gave you, oh, like I just started using, you know, this app a few days ago. And then you don't tip me and you lower my rating. Like, what did I do? <laughs> There's a lot of odd people in the world. I also like fall. Because the hoodies. This is from H&M. Last year I got it. I might have told you guys. So in August, our lease was up. We go and move somewhere else, different complex. The unit wasn't even ready. The countertop was broke. Oven wasn't plugged in the day we move in, but we ended up paying. And we only stayed there for seven days. We lost a TV. Like, yeah, I think it kind of broke or it didn't break the screen started showing black and blue after uh so the movers might have you know in the truck might have caused that we lost the couch because a couple places tore um we lost more money and why because the apartments you know uh like the unit wasn't ready like it wasn't livable the heaters weren't working so, we ended up moving out from there in seven days, but I'm so happy God uh, brought us back to our previous complex, but a different unit, and the apartment manager is really nice. They gave us a refund back, which when we heard it was more more than what we anticipated. So now we owe them back 1440 cents because they overpaid us, but there was like an error that it got uh, mixed in with someone else's or something, the balance or the refund. So Jerry's finally gonna pay them back, or tomorrow. And guess we had $40 uh, utilities for the seven days we were there, and then they wanted us to pay 400 something for the seven days we were there for rent, which place wasn't really livable, but what can you do? 
you'll live and learn. So we're back at the our previous complex now, going on second like two years. It is a nice area. I guess, how can you rent that out to people? Like, they told us they were low-staffed. Okay. That's still not an excuse. And then they tell us something about, oh, well, we were supposed to get a renovated place, and we only got a partially renovated because, oh, they said, like, you guys were in that median range, like, lower, like, low income or something, and who says that? And then my husband told a few of the co-workers, and I told a friend, they said that that was pretty much uh, income discrimination. We just want to get it, like, we don't want to hear from Cedar, like, the, the place anymore. <laughs> After all the issues that arose. Anyways, yeah, I mean, I'd give the chicken nuggets a 8 out of 10. Hamburger, it's really small. It's not really fillable. <laughs> like, you won't be full. But it's something. Um, it's like a kid's burger. That one I'd give a 7 out of 10. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what else you guys want to see coming up. I enjoy doing videos with my husband too, but we're not together currently. <laughs> like, subscribe, and comment if you enjoyed the video. See you guys in the next one.